When a woman truly desires you, it's not about your money, not your looks, not even the words you say. It's something deeper, something that makes her body lean and before her mind even catches up. And if you know how to awaken that desire, she won't just want you, she'll crave your presence. Men, let's talk about something most never truly understand. The hidden power of a woman's desire. See, real attraction isn't built in a bedroom. It's built in the way you carry yourself before she ever touches you. It's in your energy, your presence, your silence. A woman doesn't fall for a man because he's the loudest in the room. She falls because he makes her feel safe, seen, and deeply feminine in his presence. 1. The unspoken energy of masculine calm. When a man is calm, grounded, and unshaken by the world, a woman's body responds in ways she can't even explain. Have you ever noticed how women touch their hair, adjust their clothes, or smile for no reason when you walk in confident silence? That's the body recognizing masculine energy. Masculinity isn't about aggression, it's about control. The quiet confidence of a man who knows who he is, who doesn't chase, doesn't beg, doesn't prove. A woman's desire blooms in the space your calm creates. When you look into her eyes and hold her gaze just long enough to let her feel your attention, you're not just looking, you're communicating without words. She reads your stillness as strength, your silence as depth, your energy as dominance. That's when desire begins, not in what you do, but in what you don't need to do. Two, the secret language of desire, desire isn't spoken, it's felt. A woman may never tell you she's drawn to your voice, but she'll remember the tone that made her heart slow down. She may never admit that your patience turns her on, but when she feels your restraint, she knows you're not desperate. You're selective. And that drives her wild. When she's around a man who's not trying to impress, she begins to imagine him. Her mind fills in the blanks. She starts wondering what it would feel like to be wanted by you. Because you're not trying to make her want you. Men, that's the secret. The less you chase, the more she feels. Women are emotional creatures, and the more space you give her to feel, the more she connects you with pleasure, with mystery, with strength. You don't create desire by talking. You create it by embodying the man she dreams about. Calm, present, masculine, intentional. 3. Emotional intimacy. The forgotten seduction most men focus only on physical intimacy, but Jessica Opair always says, the mind is the first bedroom. Before she ever touches you, a woman wants to feel emotionally seen. Ask yourself, when was the last time you listened without trying to fix, replied without defending, or held space for her emotions without getting lost in them? That, right there, is the beginning of seduction. When a man can listen to a woman's fears, her frustrations, her little stories, and respond with calm understanding, she begins to melt. She feels safe, and safety is the birthplace of true feminine desire. Because when she feels safe, she lets go. She lets her guard down. She starts showing you the real woman beneath her armor. And once you've reached that version of her, physical intimacy becomes something sacred. Not just an act, but an emotional surrender. 4. The dance of masculine and feminine energy. Men understand this. Polarity is everything. When you're in your masculine, she naturally steps into her feminine. It's nature's design. If you start acting needy, over-texting, over-explaining, she doesn't feel that polarity anymore. She starts to pull away, not because she doesn't like you, but because you've blurred the energies. Masculine energy leads, not by control, but by clarity. You decide the direction. You make her feel like she can trust your leadership, not just in life, but in energy. The way you look at her, the way you move around her, the way you touch her hand, slow, deliberate, intentional, tells her that you're not a boy looking for attention. You're a man who knows what he wants. That balance, 
Her softness against your strength, her laughter against your calm, is where the real magic happens. That's the chemistry that doesn't fade. 5. What women truly desires, but never say out loud, every woman, no matter how modern or independent, secretly wants to feel desired by a man who doesn't lose himself in that desire. She wants a man who can look at her and say with his energy, I see you. I want you, but I don't need you to complete me. That kind of man ignites her soul. She wants to feel that you could walk away at any time but you choose not to. That your attraction isn't based on need, but on connection. And when she senses that her attraction to you deepens, because she's not just responding to your body, she's responding to your essence. Six, the power of touch and presence. Touch isn't about contact, it's about communication. The way you place your hand on her lower, back as you guide her through a door, the way you brush her arm when she laughs, the way your fingers linger just long enough to be felt, but not claimed. That's where she begins to feel your energy. Women notice these things. When your touch is respectful, slow, and intentional, it doesn't feel like taking. It feels like giving. You're not trying to own her. You're simply making her aware of your masculine presence confident, grounded, in control. That's when she starts to crave more. Not because of what you did, but because of how you made her feel. 7. The man who doesn't chase. He attracts, Jessica always says, when you stop chasing, the right woman will find her way to you. And she's right. Chasing creates pressure. Presence creates attraction. When you're busy living your purpose, becoming the best version of yourself, and moving through life with peace and confidence, women feel it. They notice the man who walks with purpose, who smiles without trying to please, who listens without seeking approval. That man doesn't need validation. And because he doesn't, he gets it effortlessly. Women respect a man who doesn't crumble under beauty, who appreciates it but doesn't worship it. That's the difference between a man she entertains and a man she adores. 8. The hidden power of intimacy, true intimacy, isn't just physical. It's the energy exchange when two people meet at the level of trust. It's the look in your eyes that tells her she's safe. It's the tone of your voice that calms her. It's, it's the way you touch her mind before you ever touch her body. That's what makes her desire last because you're not giving her lust, you're giving her depth. And when a woman finds depth in a man, she doesn't just want him, she belongs to the energy he carries. 9. Becoming the man she desires to become that man, focus less on what you say and more on what you radiate. Work on your body, not for vanity, but for confidence. Work on your mind, not for status, but for peace. Work on your purpose because a man with direction is irresistible. Women are drawn to men who move like they know where they're going. So stop trying to impress her, impress yourself. When you build yourself, your energy becomes magnetic. And that's when women start noticing, that's when they lean in. That's when desire becomes effortless. Final words, when a woman truly desires you, it's not about what you give her. It's about how you make her feel in her femininity. You awaken her softness, her laughter, her surrender. You make her feel seen safe, desired, not used. And that, my friend, is the secret power of intimacy. So walk like a man who knows his worth. Speak like a man who owns his calm. Look at her like a man who's not searching, because he's already complete. And then let her come to you. Because the truth is, when a woman truly desires you, she doesn't just fall for you. She blooms in your presence.